Our change in weather has many people wondering what can and cannot be done in the garden. News 11 meteorologist Haley Fitzpatrick is in Richmond Heights to tell us a bit more on what the experts are saying. Haley. Hey Mike, yeah, this is the time of year when the weather is really back and forth. It has a lot of people wondering if now is a good time to start freshening up the garden. Spring-like temperatures from the weekend into the early portions of this week. It had a lot of people itching to get outdoors and get their hands in some dirt. Gardening, that is. But a strong cold front Tuesday night has raised questions on if planting now is too early. Planting while they're dormant, still in that winter sleep, allows that plant to experience significantly less stress from being transplanted compared to, say, like planting in May. So capitalizing on this early opportunity leads to typically a better transplant for your trees or your shrubs. This gives them time to acclimate to their new environment instead of planting them right on the onset of the spring and summer heat. As well as annuals, these are your frost hardy plants that can withstand a light frost during the nighttime hours. Steve also mentions for nights where the temperature drops. Being prepared to cover some of your more tender plants just to get some of that frost off of them throughout the winter will make a big difference in how they survive and then transition into a, a, the real spring weather. Not only has the swing in temperatures been a tricky topic for planters, it also has for those landscaping. We had to reschedule a few jobs, like um, have a few clients we had to call earlier on to let them know, hey, we're going to have to reschedule for like, you know, April 1st. So yeah, it's quite tough. Yeah, it's like a hand and off. You might you wake up today, it's in the 60s, tomorrow it's in the 20s. Yeah, one rule of thumb to follow, if your local nursery has certain plants for sale, it is okay to get them in the ground, especially when the ground is soft enough to get a shovel in it. Like I said, it is okay to start putting them in the ground. But like we took a dive in temperatures the other night and uh, last night and the night before, any sensitive plants that you have already planted, just make sure to cover them up. Reporting here in Richmond Heights, I'm meteorologist Haley Fitzpatrick, News 11.